Yeah, it was incredible. Um, <clears throat> since we've arrived, the, the people in tour have been uh, have been unbelievable. How they've set up the hotel, how they've looked after us. So uh, we're very happy to be here and um, do a bit of a, tr a session in front of them. From I suppose arrival point of view and logistics, that's always the first couple of days just settling in. How's that gone? Yeah, brilliantly. Uh, you know, the, like I just said, the, the the people of tours and our management have put a an incredible amount of work into getting the, the training facilities to be to be really, really top class, which is what they are, and um, which is the most important. The hotel obviously being good, uh, with good food, etc. So everything's been done for us and um, no excuses now, yeah. Yeah, there's a real sense that it's now in the way, isn't it? Yeah, when you turn up to something like this today, it really hits home um, how big a deal it is. Um, not that it was it was lost on us before, but really just hits home and days like this, yeah. yeah. Andy, Oh, it's fantastic. So obviously, there's a like Johnny said, there's a lot of work that goes into it. So in in two years in the planning, it starts off on a recce, and uh, you've got to make a choice. And and by far and away, uh, we felt as a management that the, the the people of the city of Tours wanted us to be here. And when somebody wants you, and uh, and they, they they prove that with their actions, then uh, the relationships build. So um, we are delighted how we've been treated so far. Um, from, from the people of Tours and the hotel, etc. So, uh, yeah, it's a nice start getting into the, getting into the country. Also, um, this is what World, World Cups are all about, making sure that you, you understand what it's all about on the ground and feel the atmosphere of the people. Yeah, as you say, the, the tickets for this event were snapped up really, really quickly. It just shows just how much of an appetite there is for, obviously, the World Cup and the Iron Camp. But it, it marks it out as something very different from Six Nations or the very series you, you play. This is this is just something else, isn't it? It is. It's 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 one hundred percent special. And, and like I said, uh, um, uh, it's the it's the people of Tours that they've been over to Dublin. The relationship with um, the the uh, the Irish is, is 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 top class now, you know. And, and hopefully, you know, it'll be a a continued place for Irish people to come and visit um, in the future as well. Just on the squad, is there any updates on the well-being of uh, the various walking wounded? Um, some some guys are still obviously at end stage of uh, of rehabilitation, etc. So we'll see how how that progresses um, over the over the next com coming days. But other than that, all fit and, and ready to go. We've a 33-man squad that has a, a pretty important uh, intense session just after, just after this as well. At uh, our, our training ground, so we're, we're, we're looking forward to that. We had a we had a hit out yesterday just to set today up and um, into a normal test week next week, hopefully. Of course, specifically on Dan, how's his progress? He's flying it, yeah. He's um, he's a, ahead of, uh, of of schedule of where he should be. Um, so all things are pointing in a positive direction. But like I said, end stage of rehab, etc. Um, all things need to align. Of course, and as you say, you're into a full test week now and in Romania. How do you set that up in terms of team selection? You're not going to give us the team, it's not Thursday, but it, how do you go about kind of framing a team for that with an eye on Tonga and, and the remaining four games? You get a feel. I mean, when it's when a, a squad's now down to 33 anyway, you know, we've, we've not the, uh, the same type of numbers that, that we normally have, so whatever it's going to be, um, the balance of the squad and what the players need and, 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 and what's going to happen in, in, in the coming games. Uh, it comes a little bit easier because we've got 33 good players, so whatever we put out um, against Romania is going to be a fine squad. Uh, final question to Johnny. In the expectation, Johnny, you start having not played since March. You know, it, it must be great to be back in that position <coughs> to get back out and, and play a competitive game. Yeah, it's good just to be back, um, available for selection, and uh, we'll see how the the next few days go in terms of uh, hopefully can can get in the uh, some some match minutes. Um, but we'll see. Um, we know it's a it's obviously a tough pool. You want to get some some games in, but it's what's right for the team as well. So um, just looking forward to it now. Thanks, Murray. And just Dan again, what is the schedule? What's the time frame? Um, we we're, we're yet to see we're yet to see Murray so 
He's back running uh, well ahead of schedule. Um, it, it all starts off on Alter G to see whether they can they can cope with um, uh, running etc. And um, he was back running last week. You know, he, I, he was he was flying along yesterday um, with the, with the physios. So he's certainly bullish within himself, and so are the medics as well. Uh, Jack trained yesterday, um, and obviously again in stage rehab. But he's always, you know, are they able to back it up the next day, etc. So, so we'll we'll see how how that goes today. Ronan's he was fit last week, so he's he's, he's certainly um, fit to go. He did a full session yes, uh, yesterday, so he'll back that up again today. And Dev Kilcorn is again exactly the same as Ronan, fit and well. Uh, what do you think about the atmosphere here? And, and did you feel a good atmosphere? And did you expect that atmosphere? Is that, is that right? No, I didn't expect uh, <clears throat> the atmosphere to be like that. Uh, we heard there was um, a lot of people coming, but um, sometimes there can be a, not, a lot of people, not a lot of atmosphere. So uh, fair play to to the people of Tours to come out like that. It's uh, incredible by them, and uh, we're, we really appreciate it.